Bird. Guys, how would you kind of just describe tonight in general? Yeah, it was obviously very disappointing, but you know we still have ten games left in the season, so we really got to come next week. Control, really. Feel the same way. Just come back next week. Got to come back, watch film, and get corrected on things that we might not get it this night. Again, really, was more effective in the offensive line from last week. This week, the running game more effective. What did you see? You just talked there. I mean, I feel like we did a good job, but we just need to execute at the right time to be able to do the ball game. Mike and David and then Blake. Brandon, in the passing game, what do you feel like some of the issues were with you guys turning red zone opportunities into tough downs and so on? Well, we really just got to go out there and execute. You know, the little mistakes hurt us, and I think that turned into a little ball game. How would you guys describe the locker room running? Well, we just we just know we worked hard and we were disappointed, so we we gotta come back and execute. Like we need to learn from the mistakes, and tomorrow we'll watch the film and what we did wrong, we'll, we'll get improved on one the next week. Blake in the web. Latrell, uh, as a defensive player, how is it the process knowing that the defense played pretty good for large stretches of the game, but then you know a couple key plays there at the end? Yeah, it hurts, but we just know that we don't want to go back to that anymore, so we're just going to go back and get right down the thing that we didn't do good. Question, Jimmy. For, for either guy, when y'all were going into overtime, obviously at the end of regulation, it was really deflating. How? What was sort of the message to, to the team going out there for overtime, and how do you kind of regroup after that? I just keep fighting. We know that we had to fight each quarter, because they was continuing to fight, too, so just keep going on. Well, you did a really good job. I thought putting pressure on the quarterback and affecting him a little bit. Did you feel the same way? I feel like I did some things good, but then I still got a lot of things to prove on. So we're just going to get it corrected at the end. But not just you, but as a team, it looked like you did a pretty good job of harassing him. Yes, sir. I thought we did good. We're going to keep improving our abilities. Work on the things that we might not get as good. David, and then the back. Luttrell, on the last play in regulation, the long completion, what, what was that like from your perspective? Uh, I really can't give it to you because I went on the field at that time. What did you kind of see? I just seen, like, just drop back, throw it, just long ball. Uh, two sacks last week and then four more points in the second half. The pass rush was a lot better tonight. What was different this week in practice? What was different about tonight than last night? Uh, I just felt like we had, that we know as a unit that we had to get after it because we didn't want to go back. What we did last week, so we just worked out hard. Did you think that the team, the defense, was deflated when the game got into overtime? Uh, no, sir. I think we still had energy. We just wanted to go out there and fight it. Was there a message you guys can give for the fans who left the stadium disappointed and all in two? What's the message that you give to the fans? Uh, just bear with us. We're going to continue to fight. Just keep coming out and supporting us. Take a couple more for these guys, and we'll have Marcus Tatum over here as well. Marshall. Brandon on offense, last week and this week, both talking about execution after the game, it's been a, a cause of concern. When you have to say that in back-to-back -back weeks, how, how um, you know, kind of tough is that, I guess, to say? It, it's obviously very tough, but one thing we got to do, we can't, we can't change the outcome at this point, so we really have to watch the game and see what we can do better in the corner next week and try to capitalize on our stakes. More questions for these two guys? I'll let you guys keep going. We'll take questions.